something that I've been thinking about um, quite a lot today anyway, and certainly over the last couple of months, is just the speed of life. You know, people I've talked to um, in my circles, just so busy, just so, got so much to do, just got so much to do, always running, always running. And living on the, almost with the needle in the red on empty, about to burn out, full of anxiety, full of stress, and therefore not able to even enjoy their relationships. Everything is under pressure. And it just takes um, something to cause us to snap. I wonder if we would live our life a little bit more in the rhythm and the speed of Jesus, where he says that our lives are not just in the... Uh, mean more than the abundance of our possessions. Now, to have a lot is great, but what is better is to use what we have in service to God and in to enjoy the lives that we do have. I mean, what good is it we work 16, 17, 18, 19 hours a day for some people uh, and, and never get to enjoy the fruit of our labor? So I'm a very much a proponent, we must work hard. But at some point, work has to stop so that we can do family well, that we can look after our body, that we can have margin and space in life, where we can have joy, where we can have peace, where we can have enjoyment, where we can be happy, where we can live life with the people that mean the most to us, and that we can serve and treat others well, that we have space and margin to be able to give our best selves to other people. I wonder if we would have... Uh, live life less in the red zone and more in a meaningful space. You are not the, you, your life is not defined by the things that you have. You mean way more. I want to encourage you to live a significant and meaningful life and live a life with boundaries where no is okay, where uh, limiting the amounts that you work is okay. But in the amount that you do work, work hard. And when you spend time with family, enjoy that time with them. Anyways, catch you guys later.